Now, you can travel the world in search of the secret of a long life, or you can travel here to Eastbourne on a Sunday at about one o'clock. If you want to add 6.8 years to your life, move to the part of Eastbourne where Chris Mannion lives. It has the highest life expectancy in the country. It could be down to sunshine and sea air, but in many cases there could also be the Chris Mannion factor. Chris has been performing in Eastbourne for nearly four decades. He entertains people of all ages all over town. But on Sundays, he attracts a slightly more mature audience here to the Riviera Hotel for three hours of singing and dancing and thoroughly enjoying themselves. I'm really a host who plays a musical instrument and uh, a master of ceremonies, somebody who knits things together and makes things happen and uh, really tries to make people in, uh, relax and enjoy themselves. OK, this is the dance called the Blackpool Bell and of course it doesn't come from around here, it comes from Blackpool. People come to dance in various ways, line dancing, ballroom dancing, sequence dancing. Oh, the Blackpool Bell was a getaway train that went from the northern station. Then we have people to get, get up to sing, to uh, split that up. To dream, the dream. It's three hours, but it goes like three minutes. <laughs> the According to recent research by the University of California, the older we get, the happier we become. But Chris has known that for years because he sees the proof every week. When you get to the stage of life where you don't care what people think, you're going to have a good time because you don't know how much longer you've got. That's when uh, you get the best characters uh, at their best. They don't have to worry about anybody or what anybody thinks anymore. And I think people are at their very best then. That Frank Cobb day when that man rode away, I was waiting. I crossed the street to her house and she opened the door. Mick is a relative spring chicken here. He's only been coming to Chris Mannion gigs since 1974. I love all this, you know, and I think. All of them, they all love it here. You know, anyone who can't get here for any reason, you know, they get upset about it. My, my, my Delilah Tell me why, why, why Delilah yeah, They come from all over the place. Jean travels from Tunbridge Wells every Sunday. You know, she has to get a bus and a train, but she's here every week. Jim comes from London every Sunday, you know, so it's got to have something, hasn't it? No. Bleeding tone death, the lot of you. While many of Chris's regulars sing and dance here every week, some, like Neil, just come for the company and sandwiches. But what does he think of the entertainment? Pretty good on the whole. Better than you get in X Facts on most occasions. Annegret comes here to dance with her friends, and her attitude seems to sum up the mood here perfectly. There is no need to be unhappy unless you are not well. If you're not well, that's a different kettle of fish. But if you're fairly fit and um, you can get around, it's, you know, it's lovely. Old age is quite nice, really, when you put your mind to it the right way. <laughs> I'll 
pass along this way just one time only. It's not just the older folk here who appreciate the health benefits of Chris's regular Sunday shows. The hotel's Ukrainian assistant manager, Olina, is convinced that Chris is keeping his audience young. He brings inspiration and they don't feel themselves that they're old. They feel themselves young and full of energy because they come here, they see each other and they, they're just glad and happy. So it's not a stranger, it's just a friend you do not know. And so to the final performance of the day, which is always given by Jim. Hello, everybody. With his unique, rewritten version of a classic. Being born, but I love singing. And this is the best place to be if you want to sing. And he gives everyone a fair chance, whether you're a professional or amateur. And he just lets you go. I have always entertained a generation ahead of me, and they're slipping off the end now. But <laughs> I hope to keep on going as long as I can, because that's what makes you happy, isn't it? So, it's simple really. The secret to a long life is to keep on doing whatever it is that makes you happy. Hey!